Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today's video we're going to be talking about cooling off some of our conduits. They're located in such a place where they are being heated up by the GPUs next to them. You can see, if I go around this corner here, those GPUs are kind of warming up the conduits. So I'll show you guys how to fix that. If you think that's interesting, hit like, subscribe at the bell, go to CryptoLLC.org. If you're looking for someone to set up a GPU or ASIC mining farm, such as this one here, or if you want to buy yourself some GPUs, ASICs, CryptoLLC.org. All right, so here's the situation. These uh, conduits, they go under our racks, and they go and they plug into each rack, right? It makes sense. They all come up here. They're separated by this plastic separator here. That just keeps, you know, four of them in, in one hole, four per hole. So we don't want to bunch them all together because they heat up each other. Uh, these are not overloaded conduits. They're running at about, you know, 16, 17, 15 amps, whatever. They're 20 amps uh, rated, so they're fine. Everything's fine, everything's great, except they get heated up in this area. They don't get heated up <coughs> up there. You know, they don't get heated up there. They're nice and cool up there, but they are heated up in this area. So. What we did was we installed this fan right here. So this fan is just gonna blow us some cold air or some cool air. Basically we wanna just blow away the hot air, right? And the and, uh, thing is that from the bottom and up to like right here, they're not hot, they're not hot. If I put my hand over here, they're just slightly warm. But they were getting hotter as we go up. And the reason, because, uh, reason for that is because these GPUs we're thinking are probably causing a circulation of air here and they're heating up non-stop these conduits as well as uh, these ones up here and then higher and higher you can see the fifth rig up there fourth rig third rig they're kind of heating up the conduit causing the whole conduit to get heated so after installing the fan after installing that fan uh, just to see if it works and it does it works great it actually is blowing away that hot air causing it to get out of a get out of this area and it's a lot cooler so it's a lot better so it's great um, for anyone out there just wondering why would you really care if they're hot or not the reason why we care is because the hotter the copper is uh, the less efficient the copper is so we're gonna be losing wattage on that copper as it gets hotter hotter and hotter and hotter the, the actual loss in energy is gonna be going up on that copper so we don't want that to happen we don't want to lose power and also we don't want to increase the load on those breakers even though it's fine we have you know uh, three four five amps on each copper uh, that's uh, more than we need it's still better to cool it off so you don't have uh, that extra load now this is only going to be for days well, not for days. we pretty much we're going to leave that fan there for the entire entire uh, summer but this problem is only happening on those days when it's like 70 outside 70 80 you know and so on so when they when we get back to winter time, uh, then we won't need those. We'll just turn them off. So it's only for the summertime that we need those uh, fans right there. Uh, same situation over here. Again, same thing. It's fine over here. And then as I go start going up, it starts getting. It was get. It was getting hotter actually, but now it's it's fine. If I feel it up here, it's great. Even though it's the second layer, you can see it's the second layer of our two layer mining farm here. And that second layer is still fine, even though it's receiving all that heat from the first layer. So again, problem solved by just adding simple fans to the bottom. I just blow sideways and hit those uh, conduits to blow away the hot air. All right, well that's gonna be it for this video. A little short video for you guys. I wanna show you guys how we solve um, you know, various little things and anyone out there that's, uh, you know, has that, like you, you could probably pause this video and take a look at how we build things and uh, helping out any other farmer out there that wants to build a GPU or an ASIC farm. You guys can check out all our videos and see how we built it. And also, don't forget to comment in the video section, you know, in the, script, in the um, comment section, actually, not video section, comment section of this video, um, and share your tips, share your, uh, you know, your, your path, share your, how you built your farm, and you guys can help out each other. That's gonna be it for this one. Until next time, bye.